Right, good afternoon, it's uh, Stefano from IAC Systems and um, you will see now, you will witness uh, um, a procedure on a PGD-1 display connected to a Pico-3 controller that um, shows a screen with no link. Now it's, a, it's quite a typical and common uh, screen to see on um, on a first uh, connection, a first startup of these uh, displays, um, and uh, it stands for uh, um, a missing communication between the display and the controller. Now, uh, you should know that uh, both uh, display and controller are sitting on the same PLAN network, and they should be having two valid addresses in order to be properly communicating. So, in order to clear the low link uh, message, the first thing to do is to set the correct addresses on both the display and the controller. So the first thing that I will do is to set temporarily the address of the display to address 00. zero. And uh, that is done by simply pressing the three buttons on the left hand side together simultaneously until the following screen appears. You will see that the cursor is blinking on the top left hand side with the enter button my cursor moves to the next modifiable field, which from 32 I will bring this back to 00. You can either scroll down to the value 00, or otherwise you can go all the way up, and then I confirm with address 0. The confirmation screen saying display address changed has now appeared. Once the address is being set to 00, zero as I said, just for a temporary um, period of time. We have to address it to 01 the controller. How do we address the controller? It's quite simple. We have to power off and then back on the controller. And during its boot up procedure, I have to press the alarm bell and the up key together simultaneously for some time. The screen self-test, please wait, screen will appear. You have to keep pressing the buttons until the following screen appears. You can release your hands. PLAN address 0. This is the PLAN address of the controller. So, not by pressing Enter, but by pressing up and down, you can set the address of the controller. So, you can set this address 1, 2, 3, 4, until 31. Now, within a PLAN network, each controller must have its own unique address, whereas a display can be configured as shared, thus viewing more than one controller. Um, so, in this case, I only have one controller into the network, and I will assign address number 1. To confirm, I press Enter. It's not pressed properly. The blank screen will appear. The controller will try to establish connection with the display. At this point, we have to set the address of the display back to 32. So I'll press the three buttons on the side until the following screen will appear. And with by pressing Enter, my cursor will move to the modifiable field and I'll bring this back to 32. I'll press enter to confirm. We have to wait a few seconds. The no link screen may appear once again, but as you can see it clears itself because it establishes communication with the controller and you will see the main screen of the software that will be resident inside the controller. In this case, I have downloaded an AHU, an air handling unit software, so you will see the screens of the, um, of the controller. So, you're done. The screen and the controller, the LCD display, the PGD-1 controller, the PGD-1 display and the Pico-3 controller are properly communicating together. I hope this uh, tutorial has helped you. Visit our website for more tutorials or for products and more information available on our 
products, Grail products on the Air Hunting Unit softwares and more. Thank you.